Some 21,000 square kilometers, the equivalent of the size of El Salvador, were deforested in the Amazon in 2020. In other words, almost a country's worth of trees were wiped off the map. However, to understand this damage, let's see what would happen if we plant 20 million trees to solve it. Beyond producing oxygen and converting carbon dioxide, a tree can lower the temperature of the Earth's atmosphere by blocking the sun's rays. The moisture in the leaves as it evaporates also cools the air and the tree itself reduces noise pollution. A thick line of trees can achieve the same effect as two earplugs. A tree isn't only the perfect home for an animal, but also a huge ecosystem. For example, a mature oak tree can harbor as many as 500 different species. Believe it or not, they also reduce stress and lower blood pressure as well as the production of the hormone that causes anxiety. But how? When someone visits a forest or a park, they can forget the pressure of the city by reconnecting with nature. This effect increases people's happiness and improves their mental health. The major contribution of the trees is to convert carbon dioxide into oxygen and reverse climate change. CO2 contributes gas to the greenhouse effect, a phenomenon that contributes global warming by retaining the planet's heat. Now, just to be clear, this effect isn't necessarily bad. It creates an optimal temperature for the development of life on Earth. The problem is that today CO2 is produced in alarming quantities. Yes, trees can reduce carbon dioxide to a certain extent, but it would be necessary to plant 40 million trees per day to mitigate the footprint that the United States generates. That is why it is important to reduce the emission of these GHG gases, or greenhouse gases. However, in practice it hasn't been easy because there are those who believe that doing so means reducing the economic growth of nations. The idea also exists that global warming is actually a lie, arguing that it's a natural process of the Earth. The fact is that industrialization has had a real impact on the environment. And, as difficult as it may be for some, changes need to be made to avoid life in the world as we know it from coming to an end. It was estimated that there are 7,674 billion people in 2019. What if we all start by planting a tree?